And so round eight begins, and we cross the halfway point. Please note that now is not the time to continue suggesting games for me to play. That was back in the main initial release video. I've already made the list. I'm sorry. I've got to deal with a lot of people and things. I can't just keep adding and doing things. So all of the games are selected and we are more than halfway through the list. Also, a reminder that you do have to vote through the poll linked at the top of the video description. You cannot vote in the comments. It's even easier to vote through the poll than it is to vote in the comments, though. You don't even have to register for an account or anything. You click the link, you click on the games that you want, and you hit vote. Just that simple. That said, the games of today begin with... Journey. Adventure game, I suppose, for the PlayStation 3. Castlevania Symphony of the Night. Action Adventure, it's a Castlevania game, for the PlayStation. Persona 3 FES RPG and Life Sim for the PS2. Scribblenauts Puzzle Game for the DS. Pikmin Adventure Game for the GameCube. Blast Core Explosion Simulator for the Nintendo 64. Kia or Kia Dark Lineage Action Adventure Game for the PlayStation 2. Pokemon Rumble Dungeon Beat 'em Up whatever for the Wii, for the Wii WiiWare specifically. Metabots, Metabee version, RPG for the Game Boy Advance. The Last Story, action RPG for the Wii. Alundra, action adventure for the PlayStation. Pokemon White, RPG for the DS. Super Smash Bros. Brawl, specifically Subspace Emissary, fighting game for the Wii. East Origin, action adventure for the PC. Ratchet and Clank, action platformer for the PlayStation 2. Of these games, the only two that I would be doing co-op should I do them are Brawl, Subspace Emissary, I suppose, and Pokemon Rumble. As much as a lot of people would want us to co-op Persona 3, it's not gonna happen. If I do Persona 3, it's going to be just me. Also of note is, as excited as everybody out there is gonna be about Persona 3, to be honest, the game looks alright, but it just doesn't super interest it in me. I'd be a lot more interested in doing Let's Plays of a couple other games here. Symphony of the Night, for one, I've mentioned before, I'm a big Castlevania fan, so I'd be uh, I'd be uh, perfectly fine doing that one. Pokemon White is the actual only proper Pokemon game on this list, and though I'm not huge on Pokemon games, I still think I would enjoy giving it a go. Pokemon Rumble, I think as time goes on, would get a little repetitive, but it did look like a lot of fun. Journey, of course, is absolutely fantastic, and I'm very sad that I haven't had the chance to play it. So, if nothing else, I would really be excited to get the chance to play it for everybody. And personally, I think the game that I would be most excited to do on this list is East Origin. I've played through a fair amount of the game, and the bosses are frickin' insanely hard, but the game is as fair as can be in its difficulty, and it is still very, very fun. I'd probably grind a lot before the bosses, though, just because you guys really don't want to see me just die to a boss 800 times before I actually get the pattern down enough to win. But that said, those are the games of the day. Tune in next time for Round 9.